as it is around here. But uh, we we wore we were issued heavy coats and and uh, uniforms. We wore uniforms all the time. We didn't wear, didn't matter where we were. We didn't have any civilian clothes at all. Now they they wear civilian clothes most of the time. You, you were in the Army Air Corps. The women uh, women's Army Corps, oh, but yeah. stationed at the Third Air Force Base. Mm -hmm. From your uh, recollection, what other types of things did women do in World War II that were important? Well, they they, uh, they were in uh, 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 what what they called uh, motor pools, driving and and uh, uh, mechanics and that kind of thing. They did not fight. They did, or they did not um, pilot airplanes. They didn't do anything like that. All that was all men's work, but the women did all you know the paperwork, the typing, and the and all that kind of thing. Uh, even when I was in stationed in um, Tampa, I still had to do KP every. I, I think it was like every couple weeks for a day. Mm -hmm. uh, everybody, everybody had to do that. But. Um, I also got free transportation on airplanes uh, to, to come home or whatever on rare occasions. I even went to Cuba on a plane one time. The, actually, the officers uh, were going down on a flight and um, they had some room for other enlisted people to go with them. So I spent a couple nights in Havana, which was fun because I've never been back since. But that was fun then. The uh, role of uh, women in the military today is seems to be much different. Very than different. Way. Very different. You have any uh, viewpoints on that, or? Well, I think I think women are be, being acknowledged a lot uh, more, and they're doing, uh, and the women are fighting now, and and they're uh, they're doing. Uh, I, I'd say they're doing anything that the men can do now. Um, they're in, in higher positions. There weren't as many officers. Uh, there were there were officers, but but uh, and in fact, uh, there were maybe one or two generals at that time. But but there weren't nearly as many officers as there. They were mostly enlisted uh, people, women. Mm -hmm. They didn't get as far as. Uh, the pay, I remember the pay being uh, $18.75 a month. That's how much we got a month. Now, uh, it's much better now. <laughs> that uh, wasn't too bad considering that we didn't have to spend any money either. Yeah. Uh, were there shortages of things during the war? As, uh I think the civilians probably had more shortages than the, than we did. Uh, uh, I, I remember before I went in the service. I mean, we had rations on everything: sugar, uh, shoes, almost anything. Uh, were rationed. Gas, particularly, was rationed. Mm -hmm. And uh, but but we didn't seem to. I, uh, we had plenty to do. And we worked regular days. You know, full days, and uh, there were things going on at night. There, um, there was a USO in uh, uh, Sarasota, which was right nearby, and uh, we would go there at, uh, on weekends at night for dances, and we had a good time. I mean, I I thoroughly enjoyed my stay. Uh, I'm not sure I would now. But I think it's something that uh, young women uh, that don't have any thing, any uh, they don't want to go to college, or it, it's a good way to uh, spend a few years of your life. I mean, it's a good discipline. It's a very good discipline. So you you met your husband? I did meet him there. He was in the uh, he he was in the um, uh, not the 
it was a, he was a civilian. He he said he was a civilian in the army's navy. That's what he was. Uh -huh. He was he was, he was uh, training in Saint Petersburg. That's where I met him uh, at a USO there, and uh, it was like kind of like uh, not Coast Guard, but what Merchant Marine. Oh yeah. Yeah. And uh, you uh, married him on a furlough. Yeah. At the Valley View Chapel. Right. On June 30th in 1945, and then we both went back to our bases and didn't see each other again for a year, over huh. a year. It was quite a honeymoon. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, Mike, do you have anything? That you... uh, not really. Uh, no. The. Uh, the role of women, uh, in, you said before about the uh, flying airplanes. I know that there was a group of volunteer women that shuttled aircraft. Yes. Yeah. But they weren't in the in the service as such. I don't. I don't recall any women um, pilots or in, yeah. in in the service. Oh yeah. Um, that came much later. Mm -hmm. But now, uh, I mean, the w women have come a long way in all walks of life. And uh, certainly in the military, they've come a long way. And, uh, but I, I, I can honestly say that I, when I look back on, on, on it, it was a, a very good experience and a very good learning experience. And uh, it, it um, prepared me for a lot in life. I, I would, I would not be hesitant to recommend military service to almost anybody. Mm -hmm. When did the uh, you were in the WAC? Were they did they call you Wax? Yeah, <laughs> Wax. <laughs> and yeah, it actually it changed from the Auxiliary Air, um, Army Corps to just Army Corps sometime during that period when I was in the in the. Yeah. Uh, Women's Army officer. When I joined, it was the WAAC, and then it, it changed to WAAC. And I believe there were the Women's Air Force WAFs. Yeah, there were. The, yeah, the they were called what were they WAFs. Called? Yeah, waves. 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 Yeah. And uh, yes, there were waves. Yeah, and a good indication of uh, the role of women today is that there's no differentiation. No. You're, you're there isn't in the Navy any Women's or, Army Corps. Right. No. Or WAVES either. Yeah, so that's changed. Yeah, yeah. that's changed a lot. Well? But that's that's uh, almost 60 years ago, I guess, isn't it? Yeah. Time flies. Yeah. <laughs> well, uh, Daddy, thank you very much for this interview, and uh, we uh, hope you have a successful future, and uh, thank you very much on behalf of all of us for your duty that you served during World War II. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, thank well, you. You're welcome. Good luck on your project. Oh, thanks. How do you turn those off? <laughs> are, you, are you collecting a...